Sharing Hope is the event of the whole month. Some of the programs that we have done is actually we had elders write on leaves the names of loved ones who have died and then we placed them in a visual on a visual tree so that when people pass by they could pray for those loved ones and that our elders could come and see their names and know that they're, they're still being remembered. We actually took jars and created a memory jar so elders could write on what they have been grateful for in their life. Again, it might be loved ones, it might be um, a, a particular experience. And then during a ritual on an, in an evening with a harp playing, our elders dropped candles into these memory jars and we placed them along the windowsill out in the lobby. So again, the remembering of loved ones. Most of the time, people want to just get either block out the holidays or jump over the holidays because they don't think they can handle um, missing the loved one who has died. And one of my key premises was that if we don't acknowledge the loss and we don't really let ourselves experience, we miss the gift that the person was. And, and we miss the reality. They're still with us. The reality is we all grieve. Um, however, you know, our culture doesn't encourage us to acknowledge our grief and honor it. And so that's really what we recognized was to share hope gives people the opportunity to see that everyone grieves and how do we support one another.